Hell of an office, Juan. So many fun ways to fuck up soldiers. All right, let's... Want me to make you the best Supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supply with the biggest guns on the island, his anti-aircraft cannons. When you got some of that sweet uranium, you can bring it back to my office or to one of my associates. If you capture an FND base, a member of Team Juan will move in and give you access to my inventory. And don't forget, rank has its privileges. When Clara is kind enough to promote you, we'll be able to hook you up with better gear. Just have those pesos ready. Even in revolution, nothing comes free. And here's some advice, guerrilla to guerrilla. Have some fun for fuck's sake. Die with a smile on your face. You'll be back. They always come back. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cassio was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castillo controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose. 
A slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Philip Barsaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we gut Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm gonna get all these groups to sign up for Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Jefa. Yeah, yeah. I'm not Tara's best guerrilla. You are. You're not listening. Translate, Juan. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants. But she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor. From the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? And you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See? You want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush up an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. What kind of person works in a place like this? You Philly? I'm Danny. No, 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 Philly here. Whoa, what's in your bag? Nowhere I can find him. Cerveza. So who's in charge? Everything got another purpose. And you come here for a second. Did you just come here? Can you hold that down for me? That's a dead man switch. One move. So, why are you here? I'm with Clara from Libertad. Didn't she say I was coming? Clara, Libertad. That's a big name to throw around. But I don't see Clara. I only see you. So why are you here? Got family to save? Got kids? No. So what do you want out of this? I want my finger off this switch. And I want to know who's going to help me take down Castillo. OK. You're safe now. <laughs> so you're Clara's hero, huh? I'm no hero. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what it worked! Philly Magic, baby. Want us to help Libertad? You need Carlos Montero, oh. our backbone. His family is gonna save our land. Great. Take me to him. No, 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 no. Step one, Philly needs to love you. Step two, baby Montero needs to love you. Baby Montero. <laughs> See that. Chorizo, come on, let's go back. <laughs> La Espada, his daughter. 
You know, last time I heard, she went to hit that outcast plantation east of here. She likes you, you're in. A good luck finding her. La espada, oh, man. She's a fiera. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Next time I see you, I want to play with that crazy backpack, dear. No. Well, then don't let the potion get you down. <laughs> Fucking comedian. Espada is in fucking around. Shit, another one. Sweat and loyalty. Nobody else. Nobody believed. But I never doubted our ability. It is because true yards have the strength and ambition to see. What the fuck is happening up there? You're going to keep threatening me with death like it's supposed to scare me? Oh, of course. The legendary life. Who the fuck are you? Danny, from Libertad. You, baby Montero? Baby Montero? <laughs> you fucking feely. I need to talk with your father. Clara wants to make a deal. Clara's name doesn't mean shit around here. You work for Clara Garcia? You're Carlos Montero's daughter? Please don't kill me. Tell me where your lieutenant went. Promise you won't kill me first. Ah, Cayo Villarreal! Cayo Villarreal! It's so safe, Private Island. Got what you need? No. But it's enough. And him? And he's gonna tell his boss, Jose Castillo, that I'm gonna kill all of his lieutenants one by one. That's for fun. Then I'm gonna free all of the outcasts making that bullshit tobacco. That's for my people. And finally, he's gonna tell Jose that I'm gonna slit his throat right aquí. And that, that's for me. I feel like I should write this down. Just tell that short little pig fuck this word was here. And tell your friends they're on the wrong team. Let's go see papa. We'll take the horses outside. Okay. Sounds like they found the bodies you sliced up. Military's going to be on our ass. Intruders! We got soldiers down! Intruders! Binga, we got trouble! Oh, no. Gonzo!
Too much for quiet. Shit. Let's go. This way. Come on. Right behind you. Let's ride. Vamos. Huh. Oh. Don't worry. I'm not afraid. Go. Go. Easy. Good, no? Okay, I think we lost. Okay, I think we lost them. See, we're good. You ride well. You're not bad yourself. Where did you learn to shoot like that? Military Academy, 16 to 21. Mm, we can use that. I also make a mean mojito. <laughs> Believe that when I taste it. I haven't had anything but Philly septic tank shit for weeks. I'm going to pretend that's not a thing. Whoa, now. Seems like Castillo's made things pretty rough out here. His nephew Jose is the real problem for us. We call that tiny bastard Napoleon the Pequeño. Little Napoleon? Cute. The name is cuter than the man. The Monteros have been on this land for 200 years, <laughs> and now he's turned it all into slave camps for that vivido bullshit. Jose works our people non-stop with a gun to the head. Come mierda even took my papa. He was in those fields too long. Poison made him sick. Not that he'd ever admit it. Now papa leads a little revolution of his own. You're going to need libertad if you want to stop Castillo. You're not the first one to tell me that. But papa's got a bit of pride in him. Only trust his own blood. You're a Montero or you're a nobody. So what you're saying is, I'm fucked. <laughs> I, I don't know. There's something different about you. Not like the others, Clara said. Maybe he'll like you. Maybe. How far away is this camp of yours? Not far. You in a rush? No, no. It's okay. Getting some good cardio in. now, guerrera? The sword and the hero. <laughs> nice to see you two alive. But I will find it, Hannah. Oh. It was all trouble, but lucky for you, this one's good. <laughs> well, you're just in time. I'll have his making dinner. Thing? Bullshit. Who's that? My name is... I'm not asking you. Easy, Papa. This is Danny from Libertad. Libertad don't mean shit to me. And where's our blindfold? Papa, look around. These are farmers, no fighters. You want Chorizo to go out and blow up Napoleon and Pequeño? Hey, 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 hey. Leave Chorizo out of this. Our people need to learn to be a guerrilla, Camila. From us. That's why I'm here. Don't look like no guerrilla to me. All I see is a tourist. 
The tourist fucks us. It's on you, Camila. He likes you. Welcome to Finca Montero, hero. Come on, Choris. Save it for the sir, buddy. Come on. <laughs> Contact with the Monteros. How did it go? Well, Carlos wants nothing to do with. They're looking small today, go. You lost tourist? Listen, Carlos, I know you don't trust me or Clara or Libertad. Or all the other little come mierda she sent. And I don't blame you. We got no history here. You got that right. What else you know? I know that Napoleon El Pequeño stole your land. I know that the poison he sprays on your fields is killing your people. I know that you're sick. And you would rather die than ask for help. Don't throw anything away that you can use. The depot where they store the poison? Burn it to the ground. The dusters. Let's spray the tobacco. Rip them apart. The fumigators in the fields. Kill them all. You got it, Jefe. Send me a postcard. Well, Carlos wants nothing to do with me, but I get along with his daughter. I think she's my way in. You need to understand them. Become one of them. First step is understanding this camp. I'm going to have a look around. Okay, Danny. Take care of yourself. <gasps> Be nice, horse.
isn't anyone else with that shit anymore. Shit. Be careful here. Why does no one just fucking text? What is this, the 90s? step closer to earning that old man's trust.
Carlos, it's done. I got word that Jose's pissed about his poison. You fucked up his operation good. Maybe I was wrong. Up. Don't take too long with that prison truck. Hey. No on cigarros again. <laughs> Perfect. Hey, is then I need your see you at the boat. A lot of risks for one lieutenant. You want to complain? You can swim. Nice boat. Is it yours? No, I stole it. Papa taught me how to hotwire tractors when I was a kid. Boats aren't so different. Hey, we have to get Carlos a doctor. Hmm. Good luck. He's coughing blood. He needs help. Papa took me fishing once, south of Costa del Mar. He's a hell of a rancher, but a shit fisherman. No patience. Couldn't cast. Kept snagging his line on the bottom. Even hooked himself in the lip. <laughs> Got so pissed, he threw a stick of dynamite in the water. Killed a lot of fish, but also put a fucking hole in our boat. We swam five kilometers back to shore. All these boats stopped to help, but Papa told them to fuck off. What does this have to do with Carlos being sick? I'm saying that the day Carlos Montero gets help, is the day hell freezes over, Danny. Coño. You Monteros are stubborn. Not me. Just Papa. <laughs> sure. Sure. Shut up. Fucking tobacco. It was supposed to make our people rich. That's what Anton said anyway. See. Si. That's how we got elected. Yes, and a lot of us voted for him. We believed in his promises. We thought it was going to be like the old days again, like some kind of fantasy. We were so fucking wrong. If we want to change things, someone has to whip us all into shape, bring us together. And it's not going to be Papa. Carlos doesn't have a plan? His plan is don't tell anybody what the fuck you're feeling, ever. Don't trust anybody either, especially your own daughter. Just fucking react to whatever Napoleón el Pequeño throws your way. 
He's old school. Reminds me of my headmaster in the orphanage. Strict, tough as shit, but if he liked you, he had your back for life. Hmm. That kind of thinking is gonna get us all killed. We can't keep reacting to Jose. It's not working. We need to try new things, be agile, stay one step ahead of that little hijo de puta until he's dead. I'm with you. Good answer, Danny. Smoking Mexican? Tobacco out here has been vivido. Can't even smoke our own anymore. Come and me at dust. Shit. Que pas? Jose fucking Castillo. Anton's bitch of a nephew. Lo veo y no lo creo. What's he doing? He's, uh, he's... With the lieutenant, we will look here for him. Looks more like a scientist. Let's take Jose out. No. You might hit the lieutenant. What's going on? Fuck. Hey. Over there. I need to know where that scientist is going. Let's search his place for intel. Let's go. Maybe his friend by the helipad can help. We were chosen by General Castillo to patrol his personal island. That means you and me are going here. I guess we didn't hear about them. What about them? That's who we were replaced. Nobody's heard from them since they... Fuck off this, come me Over me, adelante! Over here. Madre de Dios.
This says Jose has a villa on the north side of the island. No password, idiota. Let's see what we got here. El Pequeño has a fucking torture chamber filled with outcasts. It's under the lighthouse just south of here. Cojone. Can you let me in? Done. I'll stay and see what else I can find. <laughs> Bada. Jose was using this place as his own little torture chamber. He had outcasts in there, but I freed them. I shouldn't be surprised. Good work, though, Danny. I found where that scientist works. The Singao we saw earlier. His lab's in Revmira. Meet me there. Okay. Ben, are you going to tell me what's really going on? You'll know when I need you to know.
Gracias. So why do you want this guy so bad anyway? El Come Mierda checks all the tobacco leaves for the Vivido process. We fuck up the leaves, we fuck up the cancer drugs, we fuck up Napoleon El Pequeño's operation. Make him look bad in front of old Uncle Anton. A lot of heat. So how you wanna do this? We kill soldiers until we find him. And then? And then we kill more soldiers. Simple. I like it. And hide from me. See you, engineer. Better watch my step.
Still, they're still here. Imaginación. Let's go. What are you waiting for? Mierda is right. You look like shit, hermanito. Hermanito? We've been hunting your brother this whole time? Who the hell are you? Why didn't you just tell me? Alejandro, come on. We're going home. Vete pa'l carajo. Ale. Suéltame! Cojones! I'm not going anywhere. I told you before, and I am telling you now. I believe in Castillo. I believe in Viviro and Jose. He's seen the vision through. Napoleon el Pequeño is a slave driver. He's fucking loco. <laughs> Says the person trying to kidnap me. You change your name. You change your uniform, but you are still a Montero. And Papa still got a machete up his ass. And you are running to the jungle like you did when you were five. Except now you kill people and you got yourself, what is it, the spike? The sword. Wow, clever. What? You are going to stab me now? Papa is sick. I don't care. Papa gave up on me a long time ago and you know it. Family's a bitch, no? That's what I hear. We should split up. Not a word about this to Papa. Oh, man.
master of disguise over here. Shut up and get in the back. Okay. First time going back to this place since I broke out. It used to be a school. I sent my kids there. How long were you inside? Eight months. Maybe more. Eighteen-hour days in the fields getting whipped and breathing in poison fucks with the memory. Sounds like hell. See, si, but I had Miguel. We kept each other straight. You said he was like a son to you. Toughest motherfucker I know. Raised him like he was my own. Taught him to box. He almost made Senor Yara before we got taken. How did you get out? Camila snuck in one night, sliced up three guards, took two bullets to her shoulder, grabbed a hostage and sprung me and Philly. Oh yeah, sounds like Espada. That's my girl, but she couldn't find Miguel, and by that time there was too much heat. So we left him behind with more of our people. Just hope there's something left of him. We're close, no more talk. Montero, what are you doing here? Where's Miguel? I don't know. The guards took him somewhere in the prison. Mierda. It's off. We walk. Go. I'll find Miguel. If you get caught, it's you against the fucking army. It's okay, Papa. I wore my big boy pants. Crazy motherfucker. Meet us at the gas station when you got him. Suerte. Pepinga. I don't even know what this guy looks like. That did it.
Trepinga. You better be Miguel. Let's get the fuck out of here. Lead the way. Carlos, found Miguel. Good work, tourists. Now get him out of there and meet me at the gas station. Okay. Senor Yara, come on, get in! Hell yeah, brother! I knew you'd come for me! Coño! <laughs> Sere! You look like shit! I thought you motherfuckers were on rations. <laughs> Still a dig. Still dry. Good for you. I'll drink his. Miguel. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't come for you sooner. I tried. You know I'd never forget you. No bullshit, Carlos. We do what we do to survive, Miguel. Enough talk. Give me that fucking guitar. <laughs> you did good, Torres. When I first saw you, I wanted to gut you like a crocodile, but you're a Montero now, Danny. Gracias. So, do I call you Papa now? Shut up and drink.
where Philly said it would be. Betting those animals out. Better watch myself here. The hero returns. Yeah, and the hero needs rum. Figa. What's happening here? Philly magic, babe. Mierda, I almost died for packing foam. No, 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 no. White gold. Hard to get. Birds like a motherfucker. Everything gotta know a purpose, Hiro. Even you. Danny, it's Clara. Whatever you're doing, drop it. Una nueva operación? chance to slay the lion in his den. Doesn't matter, they're our... How many times are we gonna bail them out, Papa? When does it end? Camila, this is family. I say we cut our losses. Well, you don't get a say because this isn't your fucking camp. What's going on? Jose got our people. He's gonna hand them in Verdera Square. Your own fucking fault they got cut. No, it's your fault. How many times have I told you they need to learn what it is to be a guerrilla from us? But you, you never listen. To get faith, you have to give it. I don't like it. So what? We're just going to leave them behind? Mierda. I know what that's like. Small pack. Us five. We go in, grab our people, kill whoever gets in our way. Jose is going to have military. Gonna need ice on them. Well, the, the church got a bell tower. You can see everything from there. Stay the night in the tower before the execution. Don't want anyone seeing you get up there. Got just a thing for you, Hiro. Philly rifle with a high power scope. I'll plant the gun. Miguel, me, and Camila at the square. Philly waits at the radio tower. And no cell phones. Pero hasta el final, Camila. Stop thinking about this kid. The military a chance to slay the lion in his den. Come find me in Esperanza. I'm sending you a picture of the Libertad safe house there. When you get to the Guerrillon lookout, ask about the night shift. The night shift? Okay, Clara, I'm on my way. Keep yourself busy. I'll try. There. Again.
your number on a poster about racing. Oh, if you like racing, you call the right number. We do it area style. Each track is marked with checkpoint players you gotta drive through. Try to beat the best time. You in? Fuck it. I'll try it. That's the racing spirit right there. I like you already. Suerte! Okay, Jefe, I'm here. I'll keep the engine running. Suerte. Got eyes on Jose. Not sure until I say. Hello, Yarans! You honor me today with your presence, just as I honor you with mine. These are the fake Yarans, and they have no place here in our. As punishment for their crimes, they will be hanged from the barrel of Yara's might. What's our move, Carlos? Carlos! Shit.
te pierdo, cabrón. Die here. We need to move. Espada! I got him. You cover me. Understand? Nani, we gotta oh. get him the fuck out of here! I got him! They just keep coming!
Jammed, Miguel left me a defective gun. Fuck! I knew we couldn't trust that piece of shit! They knew we were coming. The whole thing was a setup. Binga! How do you know it wasn't your brother? We already know he's a fucking traitor. And what about Philly? He's the one who knows explosives. Espada! You saved your papa, but didn't think once to save me. You left me to die in that fucking camp. Philly, I think we're losing him. You think your papa had it bad? Think of what Jose can do to a man when he has the time. Stand back, Hero! I could have given up this whole fucking camp, but I didn't! Fucking Monteros. We're all dead, Camila. Castillo's already won. Balance your stance. A lion finds calm before a kill. See, Papa. Mm -hmm. Fire me! Ah! Que bien, uncle. <laughs> Why, now you have heard of our great victory in the West. Carlos Montero is dead. 
is guerrillas on the run. The tobacco fields secure. Fire. Ay, come on, Mirada, give me that. Bien. Bien. Your cousin seeks praise, Diego. If I knew his plan, I would have told him that the Montero roots run deep in the farmlands. Two hundred years. Well, yes, uncle, I was trying to surprise you. Diego, how many of your uncle's soldiers come from the farmlands? Eighty percent, Papa. Correct. And now, he has made a martyr of the most famous Montero. <laughs> Let's see how many of his soldiers want to rebuild paradise now. Por favor. I, I... You killed my son's last bird. Run. What? Run. Moment to talk. You could tell he was in a lot of pain. Not that he ever showed it. He was a strong hijo de puta. He was a Montero. And I heard he fought well at the church square. This place will never be the same. Lo siento, Carlos. Hello, my child. Are you Father Pietro? See, si. Alejandro said you'd come. You know, I remember the day I married Carlos to his wife. So long ago. I'm sorry. The machete is gone. What? What happened? Soldados. They'll be at their favorite bar nearby. La Raja. I'll mark it on your map. Gracias, Padre. And I'm sorry about the mess. <sighs> Defendiendo a su gente con su valor y sin dar ni un paso atrás. No llores porque Carlos Montero partió con ideas de libertad. Y aunque no esté con nosotros, siempre lo vamos a recordar. Su siembra. Just because we saved you doesn't mean we want you. Come on. This is his papa's funeral. Carlos for Alejandro? Shit trade. Alejandro, you've done enough. Go. Espada, he's your brother. Yeah, not yours. How's the leg? I never knew your papa, but my family worked these lands for 50 years. I... I have intel on General Jose. Let me give you his lieutenants. Por favor. You'll need new uniforms, compais. <laughs> 